Hi everyone, my name is Pia Cortez and I am with BuyMeCoffee.com. You're looking at a BuyMeCoffee.com homepage and a quick preview while I go down through the creator of the day, um, some categories of different creators, is that BuyMeCoffee.com is really a modern platform for creators where you are able to fund your creative business. You can do this by making sure that you have your page set up and enjoy the different features that buymeacoffee.com has so that you can build your creative business. Once you have created your page and it only takes a minute, you'll be able to access one of the coolest features that we have, which is memberships. And this is what I'm going to be talking to you guys about today. So once you have your page set up, you go ahead and log in. And if you haven't logged in, I have all my uh, information here. So I'm going to go ahead and click continue. And this will bring me to the dashboard, which will give me an overview of my page. So I'll have my earnings here, visitors, and all the other good stuff that you can see. Um, I made sure that I had customized my link so that it's easy to remember, remember for people. And if I need to also embed it, um, I can go ahead and do that for my button and widget generators. But the main thing here that I really wanted to do is go to the member section where I'll be able to activate memberships. So what is memberships? You can see here that there's a bunch of different things, right? So I'll be able to post um, and publish those posts for members only. And if I have new members, uh, they'll be able to get access to a backlog of previous posts and all the content I have before. Another cool thing is I'll be able to know and do a forecast of the monthly income based on how many members I want to have and the price that I set. This tool here is really cool because it lets you see basically just that. You can toggle this and see the different prices or fees that you want to charge your members. And then you'll also be able to see, like, let's say if I have three members who are 300 members who are paying me $7 a month, that comes to about two grand. And that's pretty amazing. So it gives you a clear bird's eye view of what your marketing will look like, how you're going to promote it so that you can achieve your monthly income. So once you're done with that, um, you can go ahead and create your membership. Here is where you'll be able to set your membership price. So um, it already has um, an amount that's you know uh, set as a default, but you can feel free to go ahead and change that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to keep to the $7 membership price that I have on that previous tool that we were looking at. And the key thing to remember here is do not be afraid to set a higher price. You call the shots. This is your work. And I feel like, you know, sometimes this is where a lot of us have uh, trouble with, but you have this tool at your disposal. So feel free to go ahead and charge however, however much you think is worth your work. Once you have your membership price set up and a discounted yearly membership, which is a really cool incentive for your members to just purchase in advance, go ahead and click continue. After you've set your price, you're now able to add the rewards that your members will be getting in exchange for the monthly membership fee. This is where you'll be able to showcase the different things that you know your creative business can offer, whether it's a full catalog of your videos or music if you're a musician, uh, doing shout outs on social and, you know, following them on Instagram and Twitter if you're a content creator or sneak peeks of upcoming projects. We have these two things um, already filled out for you. And these are standard for all membership uh, options. They'll be notified by email when new members only posts are published. And it really highlights how you're supporting a creator like yourself on a monthly basis. So for me, as a writer, what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a reward for my members. And I'll just say I get a preview of a soon to be released article. Um, you can keep adding the rewards. Um, and honestly, the more rewards, the better. But you also want to keep it um, simple, uh, but in a way that showcases what your members are getting. So once you've added your rewards, go ahead and click continue. And Congratulations, your membership is now live. 
So let's see and how, let's see, let's go ahead and go back to our dashboard and see what that looks like. So now here is your members dashboard. And from here, you'll be able to see a view, an overall view of how your membership is doing in terms of how much you're getting, um, your revenue, and also your list of members. So this breaks it down for you really easily. And you have here different tabs where you can create different cool things for your members. So let's go ahead and go to special offers for a second. So here, um, I really, really love this feature because um, being able to create an offer for your membership is another incentive for them to support you. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do a discount offer type, and you can also choose to do extras, which um, you, know, you can use to attract more subscribers. But for now, I'm going to go ahead and create a discount. So I'm going to call it, let's say, new member discount. And let's say I want to offer 20% off for 12 months. And I'll put it for up to a week. And I'm going to call it uh, new member. So that way it's easy uh, for folks to remember. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to click create offer. And from there, I'll be able to share this offer. I'm going to copy the link and share this offer to um, my members, whether that's on my social, so that they have a discounted rate. Um, and, you know, you can, you have the options of editing your offer if you want to set it as a default offer and or if you want to deactivate it. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to set it as a default so that it stays there. Now that I have my first offer set, I'm going to go ahead and go to rewards, which really is basically a place where you can review the rewards that you offer. You can either take away some of these rewards or you can add a new reward. This is also the place where you can customize your thank you message for your members. And what I'm going to do is maybe I'm going to update mine. And I'll just tell them, thank you so much for subscribing to my page and for supporting my work. <clears throat> Love, Pia. So I'm just going to save the changes to that. Um, you can add a link here. I've seen some creators even record a video and they're able to, you know, really create that thank you message in a very special way. Um, through those videos. So you can feel free to go ahead and do that, or you can also link um, a GIF or a photo, uh, however way you want to do that. Um, and the more customized it is, the more personal it becomes. So I'm going to go ahead and click a preview, and this is how it looks like. So um, once I've set that up, um, you also have your settings page here where you can check the membership price that you have. You can add an image um, that will be displayed on the membership page. Um, you can even do giveaways, um, especially you know if you're just starting out with your membership feature. Um, you might want to share something with your family and close friends to help spread the word. And something that's really cool that I like doing is set this as the primary widget on your page. Now, this is really important because um, people can, you know, once people go on your page, they can have the option of doing one-time donations or one-time support. Um, but if you have your primary widget set to memberships, this will be the first thing that they see. So I'll go ahead and just save changes. I'm now ready to check out my page. So I'm gonna go here and click my page which will bring me to my Buy Me A Coffee dashboard. Here you can see that I've been able to include my bio, the information of the work that I do, a link, and over here is the membership and support, one-time support widget. If you can remember, I put that I want this to be my primary widget, and because I have a new member discount, um, it shows the discounted price over here. And it also shows you like how many days are left. So once I've set that up, I'm now ready to get the support I need from my audience. Hope this tutorial has been useful and helpful to you. If you need any help, feel free to tweet us or uh, send us a message.
at support at buymeacoffee.com. We're also on Twitter at buymeacoffee. Thanks. Till next time.